Hi, today I'm going to show you how to do a human 3D model in BioDigital. This is the assignment that provides all the instructions on how to do it, and I'm going to walk you through all of the steps. So first you're going to go to BioDigital.com. Depending on whether you have an account already or not, you're going to sign up or you're going to log back in. Once you're here, you're going to click on Complete Anatomy, which is here at the bottom. And you're going to choose between a female or male complete anatomy. I'm going to choose female. Once this is loaded, you can press edit in studio, which is here on the left. And this will take you to your own 3D model. So to start the assignment, we're going to rename the model. So up here at the top, you're going to press this marker next to the title, go to model, and rename it. I'm going to rename it HBS Human Model, and press done. This is going to be our template right here, so I'm going to press edit text, and rename it template, press done. You're done with that you're going to add a chapter you're going to click add chapter under it click duplicate template and now we're ready to start um, first we're going to have to isolate the skeletal system to do this you're going to go to anatomy which is right next to chapters come down to the skeletal system and next to it are these three dots right here you're going to click on that and then click isolate now that we have the skeletal system by itself, we can start labeling the parts that are listed here. I'm going to do one of them to show you how to label it. I'm going to do the mandible. I'm going to zoom in onto the part that I'm going to label. I'm going to press label, which is here at the top, and click the part that you want to label. This is the mandible here. And you can move this around, by the way and now it's labeled. You can rename it by pressing this on the side and you can rename it right here. I'm not gonna rename it because I was labeling the mandible and it already says that on the title. So you're gonna do the same thing for the rest of these parts here and then move on. Next, I'm gonna show you how to make these muscles show up on your model. I'm gonna do one of them which is I guess I'll do the orbicularis oris, orbicularis oris. Um, to do this, you're going to go to anatomy again on the left, press the search bar, then look up. So this is the part that I'm labeling. It's right here. I'm gonna go to the side and here's an eye right next to it. I'm gonna press that and it shows back up. To label it, you do the same thing. You click on it. And there it is. Again, you can rename it if you would like. Um, you would do that for the rest of the muscles labeled here. Once you're done with all of your labeling, you're going to turn it in. You're going to turn in a URL. And to do that, you have to press Publish down here at the bottom. I'm going to keep the name as it is and press Save. Now it's been published and we need to turn it in with a website URL. To do this, you're going to press copy URL right here. It'll copy it and you go to the assignment wherever you have to turn it in and you'll paste it and turn it in.